While the Utah Division of Emergency Management canceled the state's travel declaration alert system at 1217 this afternoon. This comes after 600 Utah residents reported receiving phone alerts by mistake. The system went into effect last Friday to send notices to the cell phones of travelers entering Utah, asking that they fill out an online health declaration. Officials say most of the false alerts were reported by people living in the St. George and Vernal areas near entry points on Utah's southern and eastern borders. We do feel very bad about that because that is not the intent. The coronavirus is really kind of a strange time that we're all going through right now. Um, we are asking for as much patience as people can muster. 8,000 people who traveled into the state by vehicle or airplane filled out the online health form, and the alert program was scheduled to continue through May 1st. The state will now continue to ask people to fill out that declaration form just on electronic road signs.